morning. It was followed up with a town hall meeting tonight at Lincoln High School. Channel 8 Eyewitness News reporter Brent Von Fleur joins us live there now. Brent? Rod, it was an all-star panel here tonight from Lincoln's police chief and the LPS superintendent to city council members and community members. But tonight's event wasn't about them. Rather, it was a chance for parents to share some of their concerns. And hundreds of parents packed an auditorium here to ask questions and share concerns when it comes to their children's safety. And topics range from additional security and focusing on mental health to community and religious involvement for students. But one thing almost everyone was in agreement about, though, that something needs to be done, and it needs to be done soon. I want to make sure that as we discuss gun violence in our community and our response to gun violence in the community, that we keep what is best for children at the front and center of the debate. This is spread throughout the United States. Um, I knew that it could be an issue, and now that we're aware that it is happening so often, um, taking the stance and trying to, you know, motivate change so that we can deter or stop something to that nature like in Florida um, is really what I'm passionate about. A hot topic tonight was that idea of adding more school resource officers. Lincoln currently has six in the public school system, which Police Chief Jeff Blymeister said tonight is less than in previous years. But as you heard in Pierce's story, they do plan to add more, and they plan to do it without raising taxes. Now, how all of that will work, that remains to be seen. Rod? All right, Brent Bonfleur reporting live from